Have you ever wondered what it's like to encounter the majestic roar of a tiger in the wild? Picture the thrill of a safari, the anticipation of the unknown, in the heart of India's Jim Corbett National Park. Imagine the allure of the wild, the pulse-quickening chase, the sheer joy of spotting diverse animals in their untamed habitat. This, dear listeners, is where the wilderness beckons, where the wild truly calls. Welcome to the world of the wild, where every moment is a surprise, every turn a new adventure. Imagine waking up to the sweet symphony of birds, the rustle of leaves, and the fragrance of fresh earth. This is how the journey begins at Jim Corbett National Park. From the moment the park gates swing open, the excitement builds. You're about to embark on an adventure into the heart of the wild, a place where nature thrives in its raw, unfiltered beauty. As the vehicle trundles down the beaten path, the anticipation is palpable. Every rustling leaf, every distant call of a bird, could be a sign of wildlife nearby. The journey is an experience in itself. It's not just about the destination, but the path that leads there. As you travel deeper into the forest, the city's distant hum gives way to the lilting melodies of nature. The air is crisp, filled with the scent of the wilderness, a blend of damp earth, fresh foliage, and the subtle hint of wildflowers. The landscape is a vibrant tapestry of greens, punctuated by bursts of colors from blooming flowers. The towering trees standing sentinel, the sunlight filtering through their dense canopy, casting dappled shadows on the forest floor. And all the while, the thrill of the unknown keeps you on the edge of your seat. Each turn in the road might reveal a majestic elephant, a graceful deer, or perhaps, if luck favors, a glimpse of the elusive tiger. The journey through the wild is just as captivating as the destination. The heart races, the camera focuses, and in a moment of sheer awe, you witness nature in its raw, untamed form. This is the thrill that awaits you in the heart of the Jim Corbett National Park. You might think that spotting wildlife is all about luck, but there's so much more to it. It's about understanding the rhythm of the wild, knowing when to stay quiet, and most importantly, having the patience to wait for the magic to unfold. Now, imagine this. You're in an open Jeep, driving through the dense forest, when suddenly, you spot a streak of orange. A magnificent Bengal tiger, in all its glory, strolls nonchalantly across your path. The sight is breathtaking, the kind that leaves an indelible mark on your memory. But it's not just the elusive tiger that calls this park home, there's a symphony of life here that's as diverse as it's fascinating. A herd of elephants might make a grand appearance, their playful calves frolicking around. Or you might spot a sloth bear, busy foraging for termites, oblivious to your presence. The park is also a paradise for bird watchers, with over 600 species of birds. From the tiny sunbirds to the majestic eagles, every feathered resident adds to the park's vibrant tapestry of life. But remember, the key to these encounters is patience. It's about letting the wild take its course, letting nature decide when to reveal its treasures. The silence of the wild is a language in itself, speaking volumes to those who are patient enough to listen. It's in these moments of quiet anticipation that you truly connect with the wild. It's not just about the thrill of the sighting, but the journey that leads to it. The wait, the silence, the anticipation, they all culminate into that one magical moment when you come face to face with the wild. In the wild, patience is rewarded with the most unforgettable sights. So sit back, stay quiet, and let the wild unfold its secrets, one encounter at a time. As the sun sets, the wild truly comes alive. Did you know that the nocturnal world of the wild is as bustling and vibrant as it is during the day? But it's a different kind of liveliness, one that's cloaked in the tranquility of the night and the mystery that it brings. Nightfall in the wild is like a symphony orchestra tuning up, with each creature playing its part, contributing to the harmony of life in darkness. Night safaris present a unique opportunity to observe this nocturnal dance of life. It's a magical experience, like stepping into a different dimension where creatures of the night rule. They are the masters of the dark, with adaptations that make them perfectly suited for life under the cover of night. Imagine spotting a pair of gleaming eyes glowing in the darkness. That's a nightjar, a nocturnal bird that comes alive when the world sleeps. Or what about the rustle in the bushes? Could be a porcupine going about its nightly wanderings. And if you're lucky, you might even catch the elusive leopard on its nocturnal prowl. Then there's the soundscape, a symphony of the night, the hoot of an owl, the croak of a frog, the chirp of a cricket, the distant roar of a tiger. They all tell a story, 
a story of life that thrives in the shadows, a narrative of survival and adaptation. It's not just about the creatures, though. The night sky above, studded with countless stars and the glow of the moon, adds to the ethereal beauty of the wild at night. The way the moonlight filters through the trees, casting long, eerie shadows, is a sight to behold. So you see, the wild at night is a world of its own, a world of mystery, of beauty, of survival. It presents a different perspective of the wild, one that's as fascinating as it is thrilling. It's a testament to the adaptability of life and the wonders of nature. The night bestows the wild with a mysterious charm that is both enchanting and thrilling. The wild speaks in a language of its own, a symphony of sounds that tells a thousand tales. Within the heart of Jim Corbett National Park, an orchestra of nature plays a melody that is both enchanting and profound. It is in these sounds, the whispers of the wild, where we find a symphony that is as old as time itself. Imagine the soft rustling of the leaves, like a thousand tiny violins playing a gentle waltz. The leaves dance in the wind, their movements creating a hushed chorus that fills the air. This rustling is not just a sound, it is a message, a secret shared between the trees and the wind. Then, there are the birds, each with a unique song to sing. The melodious trill of the magpie, the steady rhythm of the woodpecker, the high notes of the oriole, Together they form a chorus that resonates through the forest, a harmony that adds to the symphony of the wild. Each call, each song, is a piece of a larger puzzle, telling us about the life of the bird and the world it inhabits. But the symphony would not be complete without the roar of the tiger, the king of the wild. It's a sound that echoes through the jungle, a powerful note that silences all others. It's a sound that speaks of strength, of power, of a primal force that commands respect. The tiger's roar is a reminder that we are in their home, not the other way around. These sounds, the rustling of the leaves, the calls of the birds, the roar of the tiger, they are not just noises. They are the voices of the wild and they carry stories. Stories of survival, of struggle, of joy, and of life itself. To understand and appreciate the wild, we must learn to listen to these voices, to hear the symphony they create. Listen to the symphony of the wild, for it tells the most fascinating stories. It is a melody that will captivate you, a symphony that will stay with you long after you've left the wild behind. Every journey must come to an end, but the memories of the wild linger on. The sun dips below the horizon, casting long shadows that dance and play among the trees. The day's adventure is winding down, but the echoes of the wild are far from fading. Our expedition through the Jim Corbett National Park an odyssey of discovery and wonder, has been a testament to the raw, untamed beauty of nature, a reminder of how the wild can both humble and inspire us. We've encountered majestic creatures in their natural habitat, absorbed the symphony of sounds that make up the music of the wilderness, and witnessed the magical transformation of the landscape under the cloak of night. The beauty of the wild is not just in the fleeting moments of thrill and wonder but also in the profound silences, the quiet conversations between the wind and the leaves, the ripple of the river against the rocks, the gaze of a creature in the wild acknowledging your presence. These are the moments that etch themselves into your memory, painting a vibrant canvas that stays with you long after you've left the trail. The trail ends, but the journey continues. The safari may be over, but the wild has a way of staying with you. It changes the way you see the world, seeping into your consciousness, shaping your thoughts and stirring your imagination. The wild, once experienced, is never truly left behind. It lingers in the heart, a constant reminder of the delicate balance of life, the intricate dance of predator and prey, the raw beauty of survival. As we leave the park, the echoes of the wild follow us, whispering tales of the untamed and the free. The wild is not just a place, it's an experience, an emotion, a state of being. It's a call of the heart, a yearning for the unexplored, a thirst for the untamed. The wild leaves an indelible mark on the heart, a call that beckons you back, time and time again.